I had other videos in plan. I had a video in plan for today to put, but um, yeah, this Swekage video made me be like, let me debunk that real quick because Swekage makes some wonky, not arguments, but um, statements in this uh, video. So I'm gonna try to, well, debunk him. Let's get into the video, I guess. So essentially what Swekage doesn't address at all is speed in this fight. And I think he does it because he doesn't know how to how to argue how to argue against the fight Kage when it comes to speed. Because let's be real. Kakazu, um Deidara, even Itachi, their best feats while alive. I'm not talking about Edo. Edo are either stronger or weak or weaker, but I'm talking while they were in the Katsuki. Nobody has even a feat to be comparable with the fourth Raikage. Nobody's as fast as the fourth Raikage. The best feats you have in the Katsuki are like people being at best relativistic. The only character that is somehow, oh, not somehow, somewhere like fast, it's Kisame. And uh, of course, Obito. So the only fast characters that can actually keep up with the five Kage are Obito and Kisame. Those are the only ones. The other ones haven't displayed any feet remotely close to the Raikage. And I'm gonna tell you something else. The Raikage isn't even the fastest in the 5 Kage. I know he's regarded as the fastest, but Gara's sand is way faster than him. And you can see that when Gara can like intercept an, an, uh, a clash between Sasuke and the Raikage, before the Raikage can even hit Sasuke. So automatically we see there that his sand, Gara's sand is faster than the Raikage himself. Then later in the war, right, we see that he's compared with Shukaku by Rasa. And Shukaku was able to react to Madara. And Gara himself actually was able to react to Madara. Actually later in the war arc, Gara is even able to do a jutsu in the same time with Kakashi, so his sand was enough, was fast enough to, you know, to manifest um, along with the Kamui, and where Kakashi is crazy in speed, I'm not even got to get into that. Essentially, we see him fighting Genjutsu, who is literally equal to Mu. Why is that important? Because KCM Naruto needed to trick Mu to fight him, to defeat him. And he didn't even do that because he was able to split himself, right? So Mu, who kind of scales to KCM Naruto, is scales to Genjetsu, who scales to Gara, essentially. That, that's what I'm trying to say. So Gara is kind of as fast as KCM Naruto. KCM Naruto is way faster than the Raikage. And you kind of see where I'm going with that. Obito never fought, at least with his orange mask, nobody on the level of um, KCM Naruto in terms of speed. He at best dodged an attack from the Raikage, but the Raikage is slower than Gara and um, Naruto. So therefore, even Obito wouldn't be as fast as Gara's Sen. And Kisame would be even slower than that. The best I can give Kisame is that he fought base B and version 1 clock B and a little bit of version 2 but I don't think he even dodged the attack from what I remember. Then you have Tsunade who can match A in speed actually when she um, when she uses her Byakugo seal. So basically she's fast enough to match A with he, her Byakugo seal activated and this A is actually even helped by Onoki to, to be faster. So even Tsunade scales to some degree to A while he's amped by Onoki. And then you have Mei, and yes, I'm, I say Mei, who is able to actually do a Jutsu faster than A can move. So A attacks Madara and she does a Lava style Jutsu, but her Jutsu gets there before A. That's how fast it is. So her Jutsus are actually faster than the Raikage himself. She personally, I mean, uh, physically is not as fast as, the Raikage, but her Jutsus should be. So essentially what they're 
what am I where I'm going with this is that they are way faster than them. Fast enough that they could blitz the Katsuki. The only character that I see like actually doing something, it's Obito. And even then, he still is not as fast as Gara, who can react to Madara or to um, Kakashi or to, you know, even um, Genjetsu. So, yeah, that's kind of it. They're way faster. And in terms of power, if Tsunade or the Raikage hit most of them, they fucking die. There's no question about it. The only ones that can tank those attacks are probably like Kisame. Like, we know that Tsunade and the Raikage can break through the ribcage Susano of Madara. And like a Sage Mode Naruto with a giant Rasengan can't even do that. And this is the same Naruto that with Sage Mode was able to, to destroy multiple paths of pain with like one Rasengan. So you kind of imagine the difference in power between uh, Sage Naruto and Byakugo Seal Tsunade and uh, Cloaked Raikage. Like, there's a big difference between them. They actually are stronger than him. He is probably faster than them, but they are stronger than him. At least physically. So essentially what I'm getting with this is that if you look at their feats, the Raikage, Tsunade, Maze, Jutsus and Gara Sand are faster than any of the Akatsuki. Anybody in the Akatsuki. And uh, I mean, yeah, Obito and Kisame, you can scale them to most of those, but you cannot scale them to Gara, who is, I already mentioned two times how fast he is, right? So even Gara would be faster than most. Uh, Gara would be faster than any of the Akatsuki, and the other Kage would be faster than most of the Akatsuki anyway. And then you have them having physical strength enough to break to the Ripley Susan of Madara, which Sage Naruto can't, and Sage Naruto is already stronger than most Okatsuki members. So basically what I'm saying is that they can blitz and one-shot the Katsuki with a little, very little problem. Now, a thing that I have to address about uh, Swaikage's video is that he says like May can only beat Hidan, excuse me. Mei is faster than most of the Akatsuki, and her jutsu can melt Madara Susano and Sasuke Susano. So how are they fucking not gonna die against her? I don't see it. Her water style can even overpower the the fire style of Madara. Like, this is crazy, Swaikage. Stop downplaying Mei. Actually, I'm gonna make a video on Mei just just to tell you that fucking she's not fucking weak, dude. Stop saying she's weak when she's actually pretty fucking strong. Now, when it comes to Anoki, Anoki can just one-shot them like he did against like the fucking 20 or some shit um, Susano of Madara, like the wood clones Susano. And I don't think the Katsuki can even beat the wood clones Susano, to be honest. And the Five Kage actually did well against them. So, uh, yeah, I um, don't wanna don't wanna be mean, Swakage, but like your video is not very good. You didn't take speed into consideration, which is a big advantage, and also you didn't take you the only you always downplay characters like Mei or Tobirama just because you don't like them or just because uh, well you just don't like them in general, so you just downplay them, which is stupid, Swakage. Stop fucking doing that. And also you said uh, what's his name like Hidan is not even Kage level, and I'm like what the fuck? How is he? How is he not Kage level? Like, it doesn't make any fucking sense. He's Biju level. Like, what? <laughs> he's bi He's like, he's a rival to. If you're a rival to a Biju, you're Kage level. Even the weakest Biju is still like able to probably fight like the like Kage and shit. So like, I don't, I don't get it. Where's Sai Kage? Like, what's with Sai Kage in this video? Cause like, it's very bad. But um... now, when it comes to Edo, Nagato and Obi, uh, Nagato and Itachi are actually strong enough to probably solo the five Kage, not gonna lie. If anything, I think Gara would be faster, but in the same time, I don't think, I don't know if he's strong enough to fight them. So, yeah. Anyway, um, this is my debunk. I'm actually, this is not even a debunk, I'm just talking about how the five Kage can actually rip, um, uh, Akatsuki to, pray, to pieces and my only problem with um, this type of uh, battle is that people look at them like superficially and don't actually take in consideration the fact that 
those five kage are way faster and they're actually strong enough to do a lot to the katsuki so yeah um essentially that's what's happening so kage was wrong and uh, I'm I'm not saying I'm right, but I'm saying I bring a new light to the conversation. So thank you for watching the video, uh, cracked one out, and um, well, I hope so I can get a response to this because I just want to not just say debate him, but like talk to him about this. Um, anyway, yeah, bye.